Hello and good day to you. Today's video will be designing a 0 to 3 months old gada gown using the Design and Ink software. Locate your Design and Ink, click on it. Click on Standard Garment Styling, New Garment. The age group, I'm going to take baby, garment style, type, sweater, sleeve is set in. Front neck is round, back neck is straight, and in gender is a female. When you're done, click OK. Machine the knitting method we'll be using is machine knitting. Click OK when you're done. Then I'll be using the silver reed standard punch card, which is um in which has a needle bed of um, 200 needles. So I'll click OK and here I'll just put in my tension. The width of 40 stitches in centimeters is 14.8, that's for me, and 13.2 um, for the height of the height of 60 rows in centimeters. I'll do the same for the welt. And here I'll just write the, I don't want to miss it up, so I'll have to put information here. So I'm going to write tension 8 using the SK2, 2, 80 knitting machine. And the yarn I'll be using is a double knit yarn, 100% acrylic. Can put in more information now or later on you come back and put any information you desire to do so I'll click OK and the uh, ease I'll be using is a classic I want it to fit and I'll use OK I'll click OK the stand I'll use the standard size and uh, we'll be using this first one here the chest is 43 centimeters waist 43 and hip is 46.5 all in centimeters. You click OK. Now we can see our garment here, but we need to adjust the body measurement because it's a gather gown. If I was just knitting a sweater, I can go on with this measurement, but I want a gather gown. So I want to reduce it a little. This nape of so I'll, the only place I'll be altering is the nape to garment length. That's the only place I'll be altering for now. I want it to be 11.5 and I'll click OK. I'll leave the ease and everything the same and I'll just click OK. Then I'll go to this icon here. It's um, something like a tank top icon here. But it says styling for the garment body. Click on it and a menu pops up. You can see the money here. I, I don't want a welt for it because I'm going to attach it to a gather. So I'll put my welt to zero. I'll just click apply and OK. I'll have to save. You click on file, you can click on save as, and you can save. I'll just save it here as um, zero to three months. Get that gown and I'll write my name. <laughs> I can write SK20. I can write more information if I want to. So I just click OK and it's saved. To make our gather, I want to take it into the original pattern styling. Next time, I'll teach you how to use only this uh, standard garment styling to style your garter. But for now, go to original pattern styling. Sorry, original pattern drafting. I'll just click on it, and you can see. Uh, click on the icon, and you you can see uh, the shape of our garment. 
the first thing I want to do here is to select the front of the sweater because I want a buttonhole I'm going to reduce this node here down I'm going to reduce just on one side I want a buttonhole on the shoulder on one side of the, sh uh, the shoulder of the gather gown so I'm going to just move this um, just highlighted it and I'm going to click move it down a little just to one the line next grid here I have to move the second one oh sorry <laughs> undo um, I just clicked up uh, I forgot to remove my vertical mirror I don't want it to mirror on the other side so I have to make sure that it's not activated so I, it's up here you can see it's vertical mirror I'm going to deactivate it so that don't repeat the pattern I want to okay and I've already clicked on do before so I'm just going to go back and uh, reduce it so I'll knit it long to you have to line it properly so you don't want any increase or decrease there we want it to be great we don't want any increase or decrease so okay I think that's fair enough all right that's the it can be the left hand it can be the right hand side of your garment but the wrong side is facing me so this is going to be the right hand side of my garment now we can see all our garments but yes we need to make design our gather so I need to design the gather now you click on the piece you see the piece menu click on it block new piece and we'll name this new piece we want to the gather and click OK on the left hand side of the on the left hand side you will see some um, icon fit to width we want it to fit to width but since we don't know the width of the garment yet we can't fit it let's fit it to height first so I'll, I clicked on it and fit to height I want the gather to fit to 18 centimeters and I'll just click OK so now we have to fit it to width right click on your mouse to move your garment piece you know what in a guard in designing gathers to the gather is twice the size of twice the size of the uh, the let me say the back garment the back um sweat garment or the front of the upper garment like the front sweater or the back of the sweater so this garment has this um gather has to be twice the same because twice the size because we have to need to make the form the gather you have to put two stitches into one needle. So now the first thing I'm going to do here now is to highlight this um back garment and find out the width of the garment. That's with determine the width of my gather. So I'll just click off it to width is 23.25 23.25 centimeters. So if I multiply that by two because of two because I the gap the gather has to be twice the size of the gamut, I will now have to fit my gather to let me get a calculator. <laughs> That's 46.5. So my gather will fit. 
that weight of my garden now is going to be 46.5 okay and if I add this to this just for previewing purposes you see it fits but normally this is how it's going to be and we'll have this we we'll have to need two gathers to form the full gamut as this gather is for just this one and we need another one for this gamut for the back and we need another one for the front okay we need to also make another take another block piece and I'm going to call this the wealth of the gather wealth gather you can't really type much on it okay. so this one is going to fit the same we have the same width 0.5 but the height is going to be 3.5 So this is going to be our wealth. We need this wealth with the gather and then we need the gamut. We have to save now. So I will click on file. I can see save as. I can leave it like that and just put some um, original pattern drafting. Original. Or I can put it in original pattern drafting something like that and just click save and it saves it so why not join me in the next video when we'll be knitting it what I'm going to do in the next video is I will use on screen I'm not printing this time I'll use on screen knitting so I'll go to the interactive knitting and we'll knit it on screen we'll need the wealth of the gather first and we'll use the on screen Clicking on it to use the on screen method. So, have fun and join me in the next video when we need to gather gown on the SK20 knitting machine. Thank you. Bye for now.